さっさと終わらせてやろう。任務開始だ。Oh, <laughs> 
Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Dissidia Final Fantasy Opera Omnia for free. I just now realized all this time that I had the mic muted. So I guess the beginning of this episode is a little quiet. I hope that doesn't bother too many people. Alright, and I guess we have some story. Luckily, I didn't miss out on any story narration. Memories of Boyhood. Left, right, ha! Phew, alright, only eight more sets. You're like, what the heck are you doing? Look at that Zell go. Gotta admire his pep. Hey Zell, why don't you take a break already? Not yet. How am I going to kick Safer's butt if I skimp out on my workout? I'm Seed. That bum can't diss me and get away with it. Speaking of, I've been wondering, what's Seed? It's military cadets who train at the garden and pass a really tough exam to get, get to become members of an elite unit, Seed. No kidding. You must be more impressive than you look, huh? What's that supposed to mean? Is Safer Seed, too? Nah, he's forever a cadet. He's got the ability, sure, but you saw his attitude. He does seem to have a bit of a self-centered stubborn streak. Problem child, I hung out with a troop too, so I know what a pain they are to deal with. And that's why I can't let him kick me around. I'm going to get stronger, pound some sense in that stupid head of his, and put him on the straight and narrow. Ah, the passion of youth. Must be fun. So, let's train together. I know exactly how you feel. Deal! We'll race to the sunset! What sun? It's pouring! Let's go! Rah! I'll show you, Safer! Rah! First-rate sky pirate, here I come! Ah, well. No point in raining on their parade. Hold up! I'm coming, too! Alright. Okay, let's see here. Next, uh, let's see, there's this path up here in the, the north, and then there's the path that goes to this big set part in the middle. We're, of course, going to take the smaller one first. It wants me to have Laylee in my party. All right. Lail, Laylee, I, I do not know how to pronounce his name. Uh, where is he? You should be one of the lower level. Not level one. Nope, that's not him. Oh, there he is. Okay, let's go. Alright. Yep, it's another one of these uh, little boss fight things. Looks like it's in this room with like a... 
I guess it's like the armory or something. It's like we're going into this room. I wonder who we're fighting. Eh, it's just a normal, normal monsters, no, like boss type monsters. Oh, let's go. Hidden Passage Part Two. I guess it's a. We got boss fight music. I guess it's because there's just three of these things. Who knows? Story bit here? Those who must fight. This place gets spookier the more you look at it. Let's finish up and get out of here. The monsters are getting stronger too. We shouldn't stay any longer than we need to. Mog said he's choosing our destinations based on our strength. You don't say. In other words then, everything we face should be an even match. I doubt it's as convenient as that. Monsters obviously have the upper hand in this world. Things are going to get harder before they get easier. A note from Edgar. Taking that Moogle at its every word will come back to bite you. There's another deity beside the goddess who called us here. Do I have that right? The god who aims to protect the world you created by any means necessary. Spiritus. Undoubtedly, he's the one commanding Kefka and Kuja. Also, according to your Moogle? Yes. If that were the case, you'd think that trouncing that god would be the first order of business. A battle against divinity, eh? Koopo? What are you three up to over here, Koopo? Just shooting the breeze. We should get moving soon. If you don't pick it up, you'll get left behind, Koopo. It's true we don't know how much we can believe of what Mog tells us, but I trust him. Shadow, what about you? I do what I'm paid for, nothing more. Sure you do. All right. And we have another treasure here. All right, now we have this boss fight over here that leads off to the void area. Let me get my party back in order and put Rem in there. Now let's begin. Yeah. <laughs> 
Bean. Alright. I didn't check what the uh, boss was. I, mean, I guess we'll find out. Vincent. Oh, the big bad good guys have come to stop your diabolical schemes. I trust you know what needs to be done. Hmm. Save your half-witted jesting for someone who cares. I only fight for myself. Oh, what arrogance. I love it. Now show them that monstrous power of yours. Hmm. All right. Well, let's get going. Alright. Alright, close enough for HP attack. Ooh, he's got a lot of hit points, huh? Alright. Alright, solid barrel for you. Um, stone and brave attack brave attack brave attack hmm Wow, that's a lot of points. And we have a new little story bit. The Call of Chaos. He he he! Sick moves you had there. Oh, slick moves you had there. I wasn't fighting for your sake. I just want wanted to light some spark of hope in this contorted world. Like I give two licks. Struggle and strife. The rising urge to break stuff with each and every fight. Can't you just feel it? Push around lackeys to sate urges by proxy. Never ever heard such a thing so unappealing. Better to take what you want by your own sheer moxie. Do it yourself for that full-bellied feeling. I was wondering where the rhyme was. Vincent, stop taking this on all by yourself. Or stop taking this all on by yourself. What's this? What's this? You knock him about and then want to kiss and make up? If you accuse little old me of being self-serving, isn't he just as guilty? He hasn't slaughtered countless innocents, to say the least. He's nothing like you. Stop tormenting him. Hmm. Cheeky know-nothings. Fine, then. Make me. All right. I wonder if I'm going to have to 
fight another battle. Yep, looks like this is where I'm going to end up fighting Kefka. But we're going to do that. Let me just double check. Yep, Kefka. But we're going to do that next time. So if you enjoyed this Let's Play, be sure to like and subscribe and click the bell icon if you're so inclined. And I'll see you later.